All right, so color shading fishing range feature on your mobile device. We get a lot of questions about that. How exactly does that work? I'm gonna show you exactly firsthand. You go into your boating app here, make sure you got the updated version. There's several different versions. Make sure you have it renewed in its latest and greatest form. Then you just avoid any of those issues. So now you can see right now on my main map, just pretty basic. Nothing too flashy, just your black and white. Going to show you the contours. Now let's get it to look snazzy with that color feature. Hit menu. You're going to go down to map options. Right here now you can see in the middle of my screen. I hit that. I'm going to scroll down. You're going to see that fishing range feature. You can turn it on or off. Right now you can see it's off there. I'm going to hit that little button next to it. Now I get all these fun looking options here, different color boxes. You can name each color whatever you want. You can call it hot zone or whatever, but for the sake of time, we're not gonna do that. Right next to that, you can see there's a little zero to zero feet icon. I'm gonna hit that and I'm gonna tell it what that mode or what that zone's gonna mean. Let's make that pink zero to five. Zero to five feet, I'm gonna close out. Now you can see on my screen down below, everything from zero to five is gonna be that pinkish color. And to double check that it works, just close out of this. There you go, I zoom in. Now you can indeed see zero to five feet is gonna be that pink color. Let's make five to 10 feet orange. Go back into your menu, go to map options, scroll down underneath that fishing ranges feature. Now you can see that orange option, right? I click that orange option. It changes that color to orange, but we still wanna make that color stay pink. Go back, make that color pink. In order to add a new option, you wanna hit add range. Boom, now I got a secondary drop down where I can name it whatever I want. We'll make that orange. Again, we're not gonna name it for the sake of time. You're gonna go over to that zero to zero feet and you're gonna tell it exactly what you want it to be. We're gonna do five to 10 or five to 10. There you go, five to 10, close out. Now you can see down here, now you got some orange on the screen. Again, to double check, close out of here, zoom in. Sure enough, Five to 10 feet is now going to be orange. And you can add multiple levels. You can do five to 30 feet be orange. You can just go back into this menu, map options, scroll down, hit that orange option. Right now you can see it's five to 10. I can hit that and I can change it to whatever I want. I could make this five to 20, like we said. Close out. Go back to your screen. Now five to 20 feet is orange. That's your fishing range feature, color shading option to get the most out of your Navionics app. Now you can really pinpoint on certain depths. You can give yourself more productivity for visual appealing app to see what the different levels are in terms of depth ranges and color choices. Some of the colors come to personal preference, but you can really customize your Navionics app to get the most out of your day on the ice or your day on the water.